Hello PowerPoint users and welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create this beautiful 8-step workflow presentation using PowerPoint. During first half of this tutorial, we will learn how to design this infographic and during second half, we will learn how to animate it. So, without any further delay, let's get started. Let's first start with design section. As usual, let's first go to view tab and enable the guides. Next go to insert tab, select shapes and then choose curve shape. Now with starting point as center of slide, draw a 3 point curve as shown. Next, right click on this curve and choose format shape. On the right side menu, increase the width to 50 point and then change the cap type to round. Let's adjust the curve height as per design requirement and then duplicate it using Ctrl plus D. Align it to the original curve as shown and then drag to reduce its height. Next select both curves and group them together. And then duplicate this group using Ctrl plus D. Go to rotate option and flip it vertically and then align it at the lower half of the slide. Now group all curves together. Duplicate it using Ctrl plus D. Flip it horizontally and then align it to original group as shown. Finally, ungroup all shapes until each curve is selectable. Next, select the first curve. Choose the eyedropper tool and change its outline color. And then set its transparency level to 30%. Now, select the second curve, change its outline color and set its transparency level to 30%. Follow the same steps and change the color and transparency of all the curves. Let me speed up to save time. Next go to insert tab, choose shapes, select oval and then draw a circle shape through center of slide. Remove its outline and change its fill color to white. Now right click on this shape and then send it to back. Also select effects option and apply outer shadow effect. Increase the size and blur values until we get desired shadow effect. Now duplicate this circle shape using Ctrl plus D, align it centrally to slide and then reduce its size by dragging it holding down Ctrl and Shift keys. Next again duplicate this circle shape, reduce its size by dragging it holding down Ctrl and Shift keys and align it to first curve shape as shown. Drag the circle shape holding down Ctrl key to create duplicates and align it to each curves. Make sure each curve has one circle shape and they are perfectly aligned at the end of the curve. Let's quickly add required PNG icons and text fields into our design. Make sure to add title text at the middle circle shape, 8 icons into 8 small circle shapes and then finally add the text fields against each curve shapes. Let me speed up to save time. So here is the final preview of this beautiful design. Hope you all liked it. Next, we will jump into animation section of this tutorial. As usual, let's first go to animation tab and then enable the animation pane. 
Now let's select center two circle shapes and its PNG icon and text field and then apply zoom animation. For second animation, set the delay of 0.25 seconds. And for next two animations, set delay of 0.5 seconds. Next select the first curve and then apply wipe animation. Under effects option, change the animation direction to right. Next select small circle and its PNG icon. Also select first title text fields and then apply zoom animation. Start the oval animation after previous and for next three animations, set delay of 0.25 seconds. Next apply same wipe animation to second curve using animation painter and then select its small circle and PNG icon along with its title text fields and then apply zoom animation. Start the oval animation after previous and for next three animations, set the delay of 0.25 seconds. Now follow the same steps and apply wipe animation to all the curves and zoom animation to small circle shapes, PNG icons and their title text fields. Now for right side curves, remember to change wipe animation direction to left and all other steps for zoom animation will remain same. Let me speed up to save time. So here is the final preview of this beautiful animation. Hope you all liked it. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share and comment on this video. Stay tuned for next tutorial.